New video shows the moments leading up to a shootout that killed Overland Park officer Mike Mosier. The Johnson County District Attorney released that video today, saying it was key in determining exactly what happened. We have to warn you, some of the video in the story may be disturbing to some. 41 Actions reporter Nick Starling breaks down those final moments. Can you go back up to your car for just a minute, okay? No. In a nearly two minute video shot by Officer Mike Mosier's personal cell phone, you see the suspect, Philip Carney, confronting Mosier. For his safety, Mosier tells Carney to get back in his car, but Carney refuses. The conversation heats up as Mosier calls for backup. Uh -huh. I know how you guys operate. I don't trust you. Okay, well, like, like I said, I, I don't know why you stopped and got out of your car and came back to me. Moments later, you see Carney's right hand move back and take out a handgun. And we want to warn you, this part can be disturbing, as you will hear shots going off in this deadly exchange. I think it's also a good example of how, in a blink of an eye, um, something that looks like a normal situation can turn to a life and death situation. I mean, that happened that quick. And I think that, uh, that one of the reasons that I was glad that we were going to show this, as hard as it is to show, is to, to let the public know this is what we deal with every day. And, and, and things can go bad so quickly. It's video Overland Park Police Chief Frank Donchez says shows how tough the job is. You know, it's difficult for us as police officers uh, to watch this. I mean, I don't know why you stopped and got Mike was doing everything right, everything by the book. I mean, you, you heard it. I mean, he was professional, he was courteous, he was calm. Mosier was on his way to work that day, stopping a hit and run suspect. Mike was an example of the majority, the vast majority of law enforcement officers in this country that do it right. DA Steve Howe says because of the facts and this video, the use of deadly force was justified. It's the last moments of Officer Mosier's life, dying while protecting this city. We all want to go home at the end of the day. Unfortunately, Mike didn't get to go home. Reporting in Overland Park, Nick Starling, 41 Action News.